So if you joke with time, time will not wait for you. We sleep, we grow old. We sleep, we, we wake up in the morning. We are approaching the tomb. So that's what life is all about. So now listen. Try your best. You know, buy time. Buy time. Yes. Do as much as you can so that you have no regret. Because before you go back, God will give you some time to look back. One day, Pharaoh told Jacob, How old are you? And then Jacob started giving explanation. Oh, you know my life? My life? When I look at my life and that of my fathers uh, it's not the same why i just ask you a simple question how old are you tell me your age and then start giving explanation oh my life oh my youth it was very bad it was evil so now we want to prevent you from that and to prevent you to help you that do as much as you can move in acceleration move in acceleration to the glory of God the sons of Joseph came to Joshua and then they told him we are a big nation. We are a great people. Why is it that you are just giving us one allotment? This is not enough for us. We are a great nation. Add us something. And then Joshua said, what do you want me to add to you? Because I have nothing left that I can give you. All the territory has been shared already. And then he said, if you are a great people, as you have just spoken, go to the mountains and there fight defeat the enemies and take over so you have a territory for yourselves. Wow. Uh, did you get it? I want to repeat again. The sons of Joseph went to Joshua and then they told him we are a great people. We are powerful. We want something big than what you have given us. Now, can you add a small land? And then Joshua said, I don't have any other land to give to you. What I can give you is the mountains. They are still unoccupied. Go and take over. Now they said, how can we go and take over? Because there is giants there. People with chariots. People with horses. And the cities are fortified. So how can we go and take over? In the days of the Bible, giant occupied mountains. Because the mountains were secured. Once you are at the mountain, you have security. Even when the enemy is coming, from far you can see the enemy and plan how to fight the enemy. So giant were people who were aggressive. They fought and defeated people who were weak and occupied mountains. So strong nations occupied mountains. Now, the sons of Joseph believed in themselves that they were a mighty people and a powerful people. They deserved better. Now, 
Joshua says yes. I agree with you. You are a mighty people. Now go to the mountains and take over. Now the sons of Joseph said we cannot go to the mountains because mountains are dangerous. Powerful people are there. And so we cannot defeat them. They have chariots. Here is where we get our topic for today. Destiny doesn't answer to people by chance. La destiny ne répond pas aux gens par chance. Hallelujah. Amen. Destiny doesn't answer to people by chance. Here you see the sons of Joseph. They have a big vision. They believe they are a mighty people. They believe they are a strong tribe. Now, they are not ready to fight in order to receive what they deserve. But they want to be given by pity. They want to be given for free. Destiny will never answer to you if you are not ready for sacrifice.